now. Okay, let's get this thing going. I hereby call to order this meeting of the Arizona Boxing and Mixed Martial Arts Commission. Today is Wednesday, January 30th, 2019, and the time is 1.02 p.m. Would those commissioners that are in attendance please identify themselves and state as to whether they are in person or via telephone? This is Joe Pennington, I'm participating by telephone. This is Scott Peters, and I'm participating by phone. And I am Scott Fletcher, I too am on the phone. Um, item B, our license application. B1 is the 2019 Professional MMA Contestants Renewal License Application of Mr. Seth Bozinski per ARS Sections 5-227, 5-228, and AAC R19-2-C604 for persons over the age of 36 years. Um, Mr. Manessis, will you speak to Mr. Brzezinski's uh, application, please? Uh, yes, sir. Mr. Brzezinski is currently 37 years old with a pro record of 21 and 10. Um, he's an Arizona fighter. He has submitted all of his required documents, blood, application, physical. Um, because of his age, he's also submitted his MRI, uh, I'm sorry, his EKG report from a doctor. And then in addition, um, he went ahead and did an MRI uh, that was required by another commission, but we went ahead and included that in there as well, even though it's not required this time. But we still went ahead and included it in there so that the commission can review and accept it. It'll be on his um, medical record for two years. Everything is in order. He is scheduled to fight this Friday on LFA's card against Daniel Madrid. I think it's going to be a really good fight. Looking forward to that one. Um, I recommend to approve. Thank you. Commissioners, thoughts, questions for Mr. Bozinski? Uh, Mr. Chairman, uh, Mr. Manessis, uh, have you spoken with the uh, the fighter regarding his training regimen and the uh, things he's doing to prepare himself for this event? I did. As soon as I finished uh, speaking, I realized that I forgot to include that in my notes right here. So he does work out five days a week, uh, does strength and conditioning, cardio, MMA, and grappling. His current uh, walking weight is 195. His fight weight is 186. And he's approximately how, how many pounds away from that? Uh, Eight to nine pounds away from, from weighing in on weight at the scale. Mm. He looks like in decent condition right now. Don't see that being an issue. Um, so, well, I should I should have worn a tighter shirt then. I feel like crap now. Yeah. <laughs> no, I mean, he doesn't look like he's overly cut. Is what I meant. like. He's cut too much weight. He doesn't look sick. Oh, good, man. Um, tomorrow he'll probably be more sunk in and and uh, as he cuts his last eight pounds, but nothing of too much concern. Mr. Chairman, I have no further questions. Uh, I have, I have Peters? Question. Yeah, I have, a, I have a question for uh, Mr. Pazinski. What, uh, uh, Seth, what, what makes you think that, uh, that the commission, why do you think the commission should approve you? Well, given my, uh, given my previous history and the ability to perform at a high level, I feel like that hasn't wavered very much. And uh, what did, did my wife call you and ask you to ask you this? <laughs> <laughs> you, are you talking to my wife, Scott? No, um, I, I, I feel like I'm in great shape. I feel like uh, as crazy as this sounds and as cliche as it sounds, I feel like um, the biggest component to, to my physical and, and mental health going forward is the more I've learned about you know, not sparring hard, not taking the, um, the hits and rounds, uh, obviously, my last fight was a very crazy fight and a very good fight, a very entertaining fight, but I got an MRI um, and I got checked back as, as soon as I could. I don't just do the stuff that you guys recommend for, for, my, healthy, for my health. I do it for my own personal, um, my own personal life. You know, I, I promised my grandmother before she died that I would leave a little bit left for the rest of my family. So I want to leave this sport with my personality. I don't want it drifting from conversation to conversation. Now that's great. I, I was kind of giving you a hard time. I, I know you're a professional man and uh, I have no questions and uh, great answer. Hey, Scott, I hope you stubbed your toe today. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Mr. Pazinski, this is Scott Fletcher. You're usually um, after the vote, you say that <laughs> Yeah, right, right. Um, uh, you're eight or nine pounds over for a win that's a couple days off, right? Yes. Any worries about making weight? No, I used to fight at one 170 pounds um, for a long time, but 
given, like I just said, the education that we've all learned over the years, uh, there's a right and wrong way to do everything. Um, you know, I was cutting too much weight and taking too much water out of my head. Uh, you know, uh -huh. once I learned a little bit more about science, um, after you depletiate your body for more than 9% of your body weight, it takes 36 hours for your brain to rehydrate and your body automatically sends all the fluids right to your major organs because if those shut down, your body shuts down and you die and your head's the last thing to fill with water. So when you don't have, because you have a burst of sac with, with, with fluid around it. So when I, when I was cutting that much weight, I wasn't putting all that water back in my head and it's a slush effect like a, like a fishbowl when it's in a car moving. If you don't have that water in your brain and your brain slaps the side of your skull, it automatically shuts off and you lose consciousness. So since I've learned that, I moved up to 185 pounds to prevent uh, myself from getting any dumber. <laughs> Good for you. It sounds like you're on top of it. I, I was pleased to see an MRI in your application. It's, uh, it's a nice thing to have as well, you know, for, for the future. Um, I have no further questions. Doesn't sound like the other commissioners do. Is there a motion by chance? Yeah, Mr. Chairman, I move that we approve the 2019 Professional MMA Contestants uh, Renewal License application of Mr. Seth Bazinski for ARS 5-227, 5-228, and AACR 19-2-C604 for a fighter who is over the age of 36 years old. Mr. Chairman, I second that motion. We have a motion and a second. All those in favor signify by saying aye. 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 Motion carries unanimously. Congratulations, Mr. Brzezinski. Best of luck. Thank you very much. You guys have a good day. Good luck to the same. Thanks so much. Take care now. We wish you the very best. Thank you. Thank you. Um, item C is executive session. Is there a reason for executive session that I don't know about? Nothing for me, sir. There being none, let's press on to call the commission. Commission members wishing to ask questions or make comments must be recognized by the chair. Commissioners, any thoughts or questions? I have none. Nor do I, sir. Very good. And E is our call to the public. Are there members of the public who would like to chat with us? There is no public members here. Okay. They were invited. Uh, in push us. <laughs> we got to get those invites out soon. Yeah. Um, terrific. Uh, new record pending here on shortest meeting ever. Uh, F is the announcement that the next regularly scheduled commission meeting will be at 10 a.m. on Wednesday, February 13th, 2019, which pushes us towards the possibility of adjournment if there was a motion. So. Mr. Chairman, I move we adjourn. A second. We have a motion and a second. All those in favor signify by saying aye. 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 Motion carries unanimously. We are adjourned. Thank you all for your time and interest in this, and uh, we will all see you very soon.